borders. <clears throat> I think that um, I think societies are like are like bodies, and that our borders can are like membranes. And I believe that the right thing to do for freedom is that these borders should be very porous to human beings, to the to the willful and intentional part of a human being, their body and themselves. <clears throat> but they're not perfectly porous to everything. I believe we have the right at a border to check for foodstuffs, okay? So a place like California, you come up to the border of California, they stop you and they ask you if you have any fruit. It's kind of a pain, you just bought, you know, a half dozen oranges in Reno, you're driving to California and they take them. But they have a right to do that. They're trying to keep pests out of their state. They can't really stop you, but they can stop the goods. Similarly, I think that they have a right to check for, you know, diseases at the border. You know, if they want to check you for TB or anything else, I think they have the right to do that. Now, lots of tests take a while to come back. TB does. Uh, an AIDS test. Um, I'm not saying a nation sh or a state should refuse to accept, accept somebody that has a, an infectious disease, but I think it's within their, their right. And if they really want to test something that's difficult to test, then maybe before they even let you, you know, get your passport or your ticket. And then finally, I do think that borders also have the right pretty much to arbitrarily regulate goods. If you drive a tank, if you're in Mexico and you're driving your tank up the freeway, you're heading towards San Diego, they may stop you at the border if California does not allow tanks. Okay, so those are all legitimate things to check at, at this threshold, at these membranes. And it's not that we should, you know, that means that any arbitrary good could be regulated. You know, some will. You know, fireworks, again, California, using California as an example, fireworks are pretty much not legal, most fireworks in California. You can't necessarily bring them in, and that can pretty much be arbitrary to any good. But I don't think we should limit that. I even think fireworks should be a little more legal than they are in California. But I would rather, um, I would rather just admit that the, the border can be this kind of membrane that doesn't allow those things in. And then we debate, you know, we debate. If we say, hey, we don't necessarily, uh, you know, want a certain kind of disease. Somebody comes to den with dengue fever, we want to send them to a hospital. We want to just let them loose in our state. We can make those decisions, and that's legitimate. We should discuss what's humane what is uh, reasonable, but, uh, you know, are we putting more limitations on other uh, people than we are on our own citizens and questions like that. But basically, if you are a healthy person and you want to go to another country, you should be able to do that. You should be able to go to the border and sign a logbook and enter that country. And that's, that's how I think borders should work. Curious what you think. Cheers.